Hey, in this video I'm going to try and help formalize this process of use substitution a little bit. So what we do first is we try and identify what function would be sort of the main function or the outside function. In this case it will be cosine. And then we try and identify what would be an inside function. In this case it would be x squared. So what you're trying to imagine is that this function, 2x times cosine of x squared, is the result of a chain rule when you took the derivative. So the chain rule says you take the derivative of the outside and that results in cosine and then you multiply it by the derivative of the inside function. So the multiply by the derivative of the inside, so that to me says 2x. So right now we're sitting with sine of x squared plus c. So that is the integral of this function. You can check real quick. Just do a little check. And we have cosine, keep the inside alone, times 2x plus c, or no plus c. The derivative of c is 0. Okay? So let's formalize it with a, a u substitution. So you've identified the outside function and then you also have an inside function. So we say u is equal to x squared. The derivative of u, du over dx, is equal to 2x, the derivative of u. So then what we do is we multiply both sides by dx. So we're left with du equals to 2x dx. Now if we substitute every piece that has an x in it, with a u, and then we can try and take the integral. So now we have the integral of cosine of u, see so u is x squared, take out the x squared, and then we have to change this dx to a du. So 2x dx, 2x dx is equal to du. So now everything is in terms of u. The integral of cosine u is equal to sine of u plus c, and if we started with x's, we have to finish with x's. So this is now sine of x squared plus c. And notice we get the same thing. 